Hello and welcome to TNV Academy. In this session, we will focus on the scope of application of ISO 27036, a vital standard for managing information security in supplier relationships. Understanding the scope of this standard is crucial for ensuring that organizations can effectively apply it to enhance security across their supply chains. What is the scope of ISO 27036? ISO 27036 applies to organizations of all sizes and industries that engage with suppliers and third parties, particularly when sensitive information, critical systems or key services are shared or outsourced. The standard covers the entire life cycle of a supplier relationship, from selection and onboarding to monitoring and termination. It aims to ensure that information security is maintained at every stage. This broad scope makes ISO 27036 applicable to organizations in sectors such as manufacturing, healthcare, financial services, technology, and any other industry that relies on external suppliers for business operations. Key areas covered by the scope of ISO 27036 Supplier relationships across various categories. The scope of ISO 27036 encompasses all types of supply relationships, including outsourcing of services. This includes IT services, cloud computing, software development, and other outsourced functions that involve handling sensitive information. Supply of products and hardware. Organizations often rely on third parties for the supply of physical products, equipment, or hardware which may introduce vulnerabilities if not properly managed. Collaboration and Partnership Joint ventures and partnerships where information is exchanged between organizations are also included in the scope, ensuring that security is maintained during collaborative projects. Information and Communication Technology ICT Supply Chain ISO 27036 has a particular focus on managing the security risks associated with the ICT supply chain. The standard provides guidelines for ensuring that suppliers involved in the development, provision or maintenance of ICT products and services follow strong security practices. This includes software and hardware security, ensuring that suppliers adhere to security controls during the development of software or the supply and maintenance of hardware. Cloud Service Providers Managing security risks in cloud environments where sensitive data is stored or processed by third-party providers. Life Cycle of Supplier Relationships The scope of ISO 27036 applies throughout the entire life cycle of a supplier relationship. This includes selection and evaluation of suppliers. Before entering into a relationship, organizations must evaluate potential suppliers for their security capabilities. ISO 27036 provides guidance on the criteria for selecting secure and trustworthy suppliers. Contractual Security Requirements The standard outlines how security expectations should be embedded in supplier contracts, ensuring that both parties agree on the necessary controls and protocols. Ongoing monitoring and assessments Once the supplier relationship is established, ISO 27036 emphasizes the need for continuous monitoring of security performance. Regular assessments and audits are critical for identifying vulnerabilities and ensuring that security remains a priority. Termination of the relationships Even when a supplier relationship ends, security risks may persist. ISO 27036 covers the secure termination of supplier contracts, ensuring that sensitive data is handled appropriately and that access to system is revoked. Applicable to a wide range of security controls The scope of ISO 27036 is broad in terms of the security controls it covers, including Access controls, ensuring that only authorized personnel within the supplier organization have access to sensitive data or systems. Data protection, implementing encryption, secure data transfer methods, and data retention policies to protect information throughout the supplier relationship. 
Incident Management Establishing procedures for responding to security incidents involving suppliers including communication protocols and root cause analysis. Applicability across industries and geographies One of the most significant aspects of ISO 27036 is its universal applicability. Whether an organization operates in a local market or on a global scale, the principles and guidelines of ISO 27036 can be applied to ensure supplier security. This makes it relevant to organizations with international supply chains or partnerships ensuring consistency in security measures across different regions. In summary, the scope of ISO 27036 is comprehensive, covering various types of supplier relationships, the ICT supply chain and the entire life cycle of supplier management. Its application extends to all industries and geographies, providing a flexible framework to help organizations protect their information assets and manage risks in a secure and efficient manner. By following ISO 27036, organizations can safeguard their critical data, systems and services, creating more resilient and trusted supply and partnership. Thank you for joining us and stay tuned for more insights on how ISO standards can help your organization strengthen its information security practices. If you have any question, feel free to ask about this ISO and if you have found value in our videos, Please do subscribe to our channel and share it with your professional colleagues. Thank you. See you in the next video.